Hi, I'm Rocky Nichols, and this is Funny Guy Food Reviews. Today, we're having roast fish. Now, it doesn't really define the type of fish. Is this fish from the ocean? Is this fish from a river? Is this fish from a pond? Is it wild caught or artificially produced? Not sure. One thing for sure, though, it's a beautiful can. Also, I like how they make it. The top is actually the bottom, or vice versa. Now, here are some interesting notes. First of all, this is old Fisherman brand. It's also printed in some type of Asian character, but I like the fact that they put labels on for English speaking people. Roast fish ingredients, black scrapper. I suppose I could look that up on the internet. Maybe you'll even see a little window pop up on the screen showing you. Sugar, salt, soy sauce, capsicum. Heard that before, but I don't know what it is. Made in Taiwan. Nutrition facts, size, half can, servings, about two, calories, 63 per serving. So about 130 calories for this whole can. That's pretty reasonable. Now here is an, another interesting fact, shelf life, three years. Date on the can, 2015, today is 2019. Now that's four years beyond the date of the can. Was this the date of canning? Which would give me to 2015, 2018 to still be good. Or was this the date of expiration? Which means this is way old. Regardless, I'm going to try it. I've eaten some pretty crazy things before without adverse effect. This should be no different. The usual precautions, whenever you eat smelly food, paper plate and disposable fork, plenty of paper towels in case there's a tragedy, and plastic bag to wrap it all and throw it away before the wife gets home. I also like to eat with crackers as a substrate. I'm not sure why, it doesn't add any flavor, but I just don't like squishy fish without something more substantial. And I usually use saltines. Today, I may be using those with a little bit more oil and flavor. I'm not sure what they call these, but these are the more oily ones. We'll see. Let's begin by carefully popping the top and listening for that signature hissing sound because this is not filled with oil, it's filled with air. Let's see if we can detect it. Ah, there was a hissing sound. Hmm. Not a pleasant odor coming from the can, but what would one expect being dead fish? Carefully peel the can back, the lid back. And as, ooh, as usual, work the can lid a little bit at a time so it doesn't just go fling, shooting oil droplets all over your house. Carefully, when it cracks open, put that in your disposable plastic bag. Once again, not a pleasant odor. As you can see, they are separate little fish in there. I detect no heads, scales, or bones, so that's a bonus. They appear to be rather dry and rubbery, with little beads of oil on the surface. 
but they're definitely clean of any extras or are they? Let's split one apart to verify and yes they are clean of all insides. There are some bones that you can see there, but from experience, I would say the bones in a canned fish are usually undetectable. These don't look too bad. So let's try them on a saltine cracker. I may pile a few of them high because they are, they are rather small. Quite, quite pleasant. There is a little sweetness there because there is sugar. A tiny hint of spice. Wasn't expecting that. No bones, no skin, no squishiness, and they're not that chewy and rubbery as I expected. They appear to be very dry and plastic-like, but they are rather soft when chewing them. Let's try them on one of the more oily crackers. Hmm. Wow. These types of crackers takes it to another level. These are definitely good. It seems that the taste is growing on me. I really wasn't expecting much from past experience of the non-oil packed fish. These are very good. I seem to have one of the canine members of the family interested as well. But she is not welcome in the video at this point because she has not been properly trained. Perhaps after I'm finished here, I will drop a few morsels for her as well. One last try. Excellent. I can't rotate the can over now because it's open. But as you can see, lots of little fish, very clean, good flavor, no aftertaste. They go really good with oil, oily type crackers, okay with the dry saltine crackers. And I would say, since I haven't tried one, but I would say just plain out of the can. They're almost like a soft fish jerky. Really good. Fisherman, old fisherman brand, canned fish. Try them. You'll like them. Thanks for watching.